thank you for this opportunity to bring you the Harley-Davidson turnaround story. It's a turnaround story of a, of a small company from the uh, Rust Belt of mid-America on the verge of bankruptcy. In fact, we even had the press releases uh, written. And how we competed against internationally known companies like Honda, Kawasaki, and Suzuki. And, well, first of all, we had established a brand identity. A product can be imitated, but a brand cannot. And simply, what is a brand? Well, it's what you are and who you are and who you sell your products to and what they expect out of your product. Harley-Davidson builds big, beautiful American motorcycles for motor enthusiasts who want their motorcycles and their products to be symbols of strength, freedom, individuality, and Americana, and also want to participate and share in the Harley-Davidson heritage, tradition, and mystique. So we looked back into the old archives, and we found out that we had been selling clothing and all kinds of accessories to our riders since 1914. And the thought came to us, if we're in the motorcycle business, why can't we be in the motor clothes business? So we manufacture a complete line of clothing that is functional and fashionable for all age groups. You look through our catalog, you'll find people in their 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s. Turn negatives into positives, and Harleys at that time were called hogs. And I don't know where that name came from, racing or something like that, but that was something that the press was always using in a negative way to identify our motorcycles. And what we wanted to do was take that and put it in a positive way. So we ran this ad with this piggy bank. We talked about the durability and the rebuildability of the motorcycle and the fact that they didn't depreciate. And we ran this ad, and the telephone just ran off the hook for the next three months. And we sold 35,000 of these piggy banks at 35 bucks a piece over the next year. That fifth P that we call the most important part of the success of any business plan. And that fifth P with us is people. Because people, they're the difference between winning and losing. They're the difference between success and failure. People bring the passion to the business. The Harley Owners Group is something that has really helped that and one of the major factors. We have right now, globally, 460,000 people that pay us $40 a year to belong to this club. And we send them every other month a little book called Hog Tales. And riding a motorcycle is what's all about because that's what builds loyalty. In the presentation, you, you've picked up a couple of pearls of wisdom, and I really hope that over the next last couple of days and the next several days that uh, you really find some things that you can use in your business back at home because it's coming with these fresh ideas and exchanging ideas with your peers is really what built the success of this organization. But if not, I'd like to leave you with this last thought. If you do what you've always done, you're going to get what you've always got. And with that, I say thank you. You've been a wonderful audience. I really thank you for the